Hey, what's up guys? It's that Land of Boy with 6000 here. Uh, well, first thing I'm going to do is, uh, be ready to put your thinking caps on. Because we're going to have a quick ride of journey with Matt. And you probably all know the film theory, or film theorist. Film? 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 Film theory? Well, wh whatever. Um, check out their channel. It's called Film Theory. Yeah, but you need to put on your thinking caps. Now, I wasn't thinking that when I make a YouTube channel, <laughs> I was going to go down this fast. But no, this is not going to be... A channel where we make a bunch of theories and ruin your childhood life. <laughs> Since I'm a child, he ruins your childhood. Without further ado, we're going to be looking onto a theory that I've been looking at for quite a while. Did Jack have to die? Now... What Jack? There's like the there's a Jack in my school. I'm not giving out his last name because oh shoot, private information. But still, Jack Dawson. Now, if any of you have seen Titanic, well, yeah. Okay, yeah, Jack didn't have to die. And this is basically the simplest part of where we're going to get it. And we're going to have a few other film theories, or theories, whatever. And we're going to be looking at how long they could have stayed together. Because Rose... Died about 12 years ago. She died in, like, December of 2006, I'm pretty sure. Well, whatever. is One thing is to say, I wouldn't have been able to see her, see her in my lifetime. And, yeah, Jack didn't have to die. Because if you've ever seen the scene where Rose is in a boat and she... Try, she's about to get on a boat, but then after a few, after like a minute or two, she jumps out and then runs to find Jack, and then they meet up. Now, if she would have just stayed on the lifeboat, she would have been safe, even though she was safe, even if our, in our universe right now. But Jack Dawson could have been safe because he could have found that piece of debris, and there was only there. May have been space for two people, but we'll cover that in another video. But what I'm trying to say is that once they they could have been together, because Jack could have found that debris, floated on it, waited for the Carpathia to come, and then they would have seen each other about two hours later. They would just, yeah, I mean, come on, Jack... I, I don't get it. It's, and then, well, Jack died. He died in 1912, April 15th, around 2.45 a.m., maybe? Somewhere in the 2 a.m.s. He maybe died at, like, 2.36 a.m. It's somewhere in the 2.30s. Uh, we aren't sure. I'm not, a, I'm not in a team. I did all this research by myself. <laughs> So I'm just doing research for a, uh, I'm a nine-year-old, and then there's film theory. I'm going to estimate that he's in his early 30s, maybe. Yeah, and plus he has teams of work workers to do it. So, ha, you make me laugh, and I don't think he's ever covered this. Do <laughs> do I have horrible shout track. <laughs> now I'm trying to not I'm trying to make this video as possibly not cringy at all but you know how it gets us <laughs> 
YouTube will probably delete me. Hashtag YouTube, please don't delete me. <laughs> Without further ado, they could have remet, and they probably would have been living with each other. Jack was like 20, she was 17. That's the main in life, Sam. So, let's just say... Okay, so, Rose, she lived to be... Drumroll, please! A hundred... I don't have an editor, so let's do a drum roll with this. They could have... If Jack would have lived as long as Rose did... They could have been with each other for I'm doing the calculations and it adds up they could have been with each other for 91 years and of course Jack would have probably die a little bit earlier before his counterpart because I'm pretty sure Rose was younger than Jack at the time. I think Jack was like 20. I don't know. I didn't research that. I should have gotten to that. But yeah, uh, I was just making this video for just the theory. And yeah. And they would have been happily and plus... One thing, another thing that I don't get. This is going to top it off. Why did Rose throw literally like a multi-thousand dollars worth of a piece of jewelry off the ship? Just, I, 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 there's nothing explaining that. If I was Rose, I would keep on to it. I would either keep on to it, or I would, um, what is it, put it, I would sell it, or either keep it on, keep on to me. I just don't get, why would you throw multi-thousand dollar worth of jewelry, and you, I don't get why, in the gruesomest of worlds, so... What I'm trying to say here is Rose was actually pretty selfish. I mean, yeah, it feels good when they reunite together. But at the end, Jack dies. And plus, I think her, her life would be better off with him. Now I can't I can't stand their personal relationship, but yeah, that will conclude our our video for today. See you guys in the next one. <laughs>